Hey Siri, turn on Christmas tree. Good morning. If you're new here, my name is Henley. And you should totally subscribe and join the crew. I've been getting some comments lately to do a day in the life. So I decided to vlog my day to day. First thing I'm going to do is put on my watch. It's currently 9.05. Okay, let's make this bed. My bed is not made. Now it's time for an outfit, but I don't know what to wear. Hey Siri, what's the weather today? It looks like it will be cloudy today. Daytime temperatures will hover around 52 degrees with overnight lows around 41. Okay, 52 and 41, so kind of chilly. So pants and maybe a sweatshirt. Mm, I have my Nike sweatpants. Let's try my closet now. I think I figured it out. Fit check. Here's the Lululemon scuba. Athletic tank top. Nike joggers and UGG slippers. I slept with my hair wet last night, so now it's kind of like crazy. Now this is the time where I like to clean my face and then put eye patches on and do like my journaling and stuff and devotional. I'm going to go ice my face real quick. I think I'm going to use the Tula eye mask today. And then it says, it says to wear them for 10 to 20 minutes, which is perfect. They actually stopped making these for a little bit. And these are really good, so I was kind of sad. But now I got some for Christmas. And this is my first time using them, and I can't wait. There's the first one. Okay, now that we have the eye patches on, we are going to be doing five minute journal and my devotional. Today is January 6th. The quote of the day, there's something wonderfully bold and liberating about saying yes to our entire imperfect and messy life. Three things I'm grateful for. What would make today great? Daily affirmation. Bible verse of the day. We have thought on your loving kindness, O God. Psalms 48, 9. Today's devotional was talking about how God never stops loving you and like just to close your eyes and think about that for a second and how that makes you feel. My hair is actually kind of driving me crazy so I'm going to pull it up. It has been 10 minutes so we're going to take these off. Now I'm going to be doing my skincare and telling you some of my 2023 2024 goals so I don't really like to do resolutions because I think you should just like set a goal or just do it in general not wait till the new year but I do like to set goals for myself so one of my goals is to do my five minute journal 
and devotional every morning and night. This year, I'm going to try to get closer with God and like try to read my devotional every day. That's been like the highlight of my mornings and like days is just to read my devotional and do my five minute journal. So I guess that means my goal is working. I totally forgot to do my snail mucin. So I guess I'm just gonna do that real quick. Another one of my goals is to do 90 sit ups a day. I'm trying to get abs by summer. That one's kind of a silly one, but it makes me feel good, so we're going to try to do it. I have been keeping up with that goal as well. Should I put another thin layer of moisturizer on? Because we're supposed to do serum and then moisturizer, so it kind of feels wrong to do moisturizer and then serum. If that makes sense. But we're just going to do a thin layer. And nothing crazy. Another one of my goals is to not be on my phone like as much or like in the car not be on my phone as much like just like kind of living in the moment and not relying on it all the time you know what I mean. I allow myself some time on it just like not too much or I'm just scrolling on reels wasting my life away. If that makes any sense. The sunscreen smells like this boba place I go to. Which it's normally never smell like that. But I kind of don't like it. I want to be more consistent on YouTube. And just like not post random stuff. Like I actually want to put hard work into it. And like it be like good. You know what I mean? I try to do that now. Just with school it sometimes get hard to like post a lot if that makes sense i've been saying if that makes sense a lot so sorry about that <laughs> but yeah i'm just trying to post more and this is my second long video my first one was my what i got for christmas haul i normally just do shorts and stuff but if you have any more ideas for me i would be open to trying them but yeah, I really love doing YouTube and stuff. I started like May last year, like the last day of school. So we're getting almost a year. I also want to thank y'all for 200 plus subscribers and all of my like day one people. It means a lot to me that people actually like my videos and like care like to enough to subscribe like that just blows my mind and i wouldn't be here without god or like anyone that supports me so thank y'all i can tell like a big difference from when i first started to now because when i used to do my get ready with me's like i did not know what to talk about which still happens but my voice was just very different and i just it was awkward like i didn't know how to do it I and mean, i still don't know how to do it but we're just winging it and being myself it's fun to like document like your life and like see how you oh there's hair and like seeing how you've changed over the years in my case almost a year i hope 2024 treats you all so well and we can stick through it together and push through it's gonna be a great year i can feel it one thing i've noticed while doing youtube and like filming get ready with me and stuff is how bad like my grammar is sometimes like it's not bad i just cut off some words <laughs> i'm just like whoa what just happened did i have a stroke i almost forgot to set my skincare i literally don't even have makeup on But it feels good, so my skincare isn't going anywhere. Skincare is complete. I've been trying to drink electrolytes every day, so today we're gonna do kiwi strawberry.
the kiwi strawberry tastes just like a kiwi strawberry propel. I'm gonna eat a chocolate muffin from Trader Joe's for breakfast. These chocolate muffins are so good. The pumpkin ones are really good too. Coffee delivery. I got a caramel and cream cold brew. From Bullet. Today, me and Harper are gonna tackle our bathroom that is filled with products that we probably don't even need anymore. Why did it get this bad? I don't know. We just realized we did the same face. <laughs> We threw away one bag of products, and here is the finish. Look. This really took two minutes. And we've been putting it off for like two years. Bruh. We're headed to Tractor Supply. Carhartt. <laughs> Christmas candle. This is the best brand for candles, in my opinion. The amount of these candles I've gone through this season, it's kind of crazy. I like that one. That one just went right out, so got a new one. That sound is quite annoying. I'm going to do some homework. First, I'm going to take my two vitamins and then I'm going to take my Tula probiotic. I'm done doing homework now. I was working on a project for my character and career class. It's a role model project and I'm doing my sister, but I got confused on like two of the slides cause I didn't know the difference. So I'll have to ask my teacher that on Monday, but that's what's happening at the moment. We aren't really doing much today. So I don't really know what I'm gonna do next, but I might go see what my sister's doing. Maybe bother her a little bit. Not really, but just see if she wants to hang out a little bit. Because I don't really want to do my workout at the moment. So, yeah. Where are we going? We are going to Salt Boutique. She's picking out an outfit for a little dinner party thing. So, I'm looking for one. Yeah, looking for one. So, I decided to come along. Do you have any words of wisdom? It being a new year, I think you should, everyone should focus more on yourself. Stop trying to please people. Stop trying to do what others want you to do. Instead, more focus on what brings you joy and weeding out all the negativity in your life. People that don't bring you joy. Um, I tell my girls all the time, we well, don't have to be best friends with everyone we can like everyone but we don't have to be best friends with everyone and sometimes we feel that pull to always want to be a yes girl or to always say yes and we it's okay to say no no is a sentence no doesn't require an explanation so just remember that guys what's one goal you have for 2024 besides that um for me personally is spending more time with God and diving deeper into like my Bible and more health goals as far as like being healthier and focusing on that part but mainly my for myself the words of wisdom is in my life as well because I feel like so often we get so pulled and just in the routine of always feeling like we have to say yes or always feeling like we have to give an excuse or a reason or just feeling like we want we have to do something when we don't necessarily want to and um I also want to focus more on people who give me the same energy like I'm tired of focusing
focusing on people or even just spending time, putting time into relationships that aren't giving back. Um, and just kind of taking a look at my friends in my life or who I think are friends but really in the end aren't really putting anything into the friendship so maybe they're not really a friend that I need to spend time on. Well, thank you. You're welcome. Any time, come back for more TED Talk. <laughs> oh my I'm here every day. <laughs> <laughs> she loves me. <laughs> God. God damn us. Womp womp. Never mind, they close at 1.30. Oh, for two times of trying to go to this store. The first time we went, they were closed as well, so maybe it's a sign. We got a late lunch of Wendy's. 10 count spicy nugget. And some fries that we already ate on the way home. POV, your nose won't stop bleeding. I did this yesterday too. So I got a humidifier, so maybe this will help. Here's a haul of what we got from Dollar Tree. First thing is this window cleaner to put in one of these phone-like cleaners things. This is not from Dollar Tree, by the way. I got my sister some hot and cold iPads. She's getting into skincare lately, so I got her some of these. We got some silk scrunchies, cutie little band-aids. The last thing are these pairs of sunglasses. I got these because I think it'd be cool on Valentine's Day to like go around and get like pictures with everyone in these. Kind of like, I don't know, see, I've seen all these reels and it's like, there's these I Love Jesus sunglasses and they'll go to like a camp or something and get a bunch of pictures with people wearing them. So my vision for like these, I don't know, could be cool. I just put the cleaner in there it's been a minute since i last updated you but just been scrolling on reels for like a while now i tried on my dance dress and like figured out what shoes i'm gonna wear with it and figured out the plans for the dance i will keep you posted when i do something next it's currently 608 so let's do a workout A little behind on my vlogmas, so I'm watching Nicole Leno while I eat my ice, of course. It's about that time to start winding down, so let's get a shower. <laughs> I'm out of the shower now, but I forgot to do my five minute journal and prayer before the shower, so we're gonna do it now. Highlights of the day. What did I learn today? I'm gonna read you what I wrote today. Okay, so I'm grateful for my YouTube channel, school slash teachers, and this journal. What would make today great? Filming all day for my video, working out, and having a relaxing and chill day. Daily affirmations. I am proud of myself. And then tonight, highlights of my day. Talking with my mom in the car, getting ready this morning, and vlogging. What did I learn today? It's okay to have a chill day. I've actually enjoyed this five minute journal so much. And it's like so satisfying, like filling out a page at the end of the day. It's like a little accomplishment. So I love it. Time for my prayer. Tonight's Bible verse says, all scripture 
is inspired by God and is used to teach us what is true and to make us realize what is wrong in our lives. It corrects us when we are wrong and teaches us to do what is right. 2 Timothy 3.16 Time for skincare. Now it's time to unmake my bed. It's currently now nine o'clock. I think that's gonna be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give it a like. If you didn't, don't do anything at all. And I'll see you next time. Bye guys.